we already discussed the critical section problem and um, there are different solutions for the critical section problem they are a uh, software solution software solution and uh, hardware solution finally operating system solution okay so different types of software solutions for critical section problem are peterson algorithm peterson's algorithm and bakery algorithm bakery algorithm so one thing you should have to bear in mind is peterson algorithm is for two processes and bakery algorithm for n processes this, these are the solutions for critical section problem software solution includes peterson algorithm which is for two processes bakery algorithm for n processes and next there are hardware solutions like disable or enable interrupt disable or enable interrupt and test set instructions test and set instructions and finally operating system as semaphores which is more important semaphores which is specified in your syllabus that's why we are discussing semaphore alone remaining them uh, are now discussing in our topic so we are moving to the operating system solution which is semaphore semaphore uh, is a variable okay is a variable used to control the critical section semaphore is a variable used to control the critical section and it has only two operations only two operations they are binary Uh, sorry sorry uh, two operations are wait that is p operation and uh, signal that is v operation so p in the varnya wait aana, v is signal semaphore in the varnya critical section problem in the operating system solution aana. so it will run the operations aana, which is also important wait operation and signal operation and uh, there are two types of semaphores okay they are binary semaphore and uh, counting semaphore binary semaphore and uh, counting semaphore let's first check counting semaphore this is actually counting semaphore p operation and v operation here you can see s is what maximum number of processes that can be ender maximum number of processes that can be that can enter into a critical section when any process want to enter critical section it execute p operation when any process comes out from critical section v operation is executed so i'll explain with an uh, with an example suppose a resource uh, like like we have three printers assume we have three printers and seven systems okay so here is the under moon printer under so every day is in the end seven system three resources so is equal to what is equal to three clear maximum number of resources are s in the bar in the so three okay so while one system using printer okay so it will enter to the p operation p operation in the bar in wait s like over no then while s less than or equal to zero e condition true or no s less than or equal to zero is true okay so I'm sorry, is less than or equal to zero in the condition is false because 
here we have 3 less than or equal to 0 and then show each other. 3 uh, not equal to less than or equal to 0, 3 is greater than 0. Okay, so this condition is wrong. That's why it will end up to the next statement. Okay, next statement like you can see a, a semicolon here. Your condition uh, wrong anangil matra next statement like varu lo. E condition true anangil adu false avana the vare endium execute idon dikim. E loop in athana karana karangi kondikim. Adana namla padicha. Kanam namla four num while naka loop it to anyal. Next statement like a poan budimutana. Next statement like a poon the a prani or condition false avana the prana poon the. Okay. So, here this condition is false. That's why a resource is allocated to that system. So, that S becomes what? That means while one system approached the P operation and one system using the printer. So, S becomes what? 2. Okay. So, after usage, that process will uh, move on to the V operations. V operation will end on. And that is, if a system is printed, you use it. Can you? In India, a printer will be put together. So signal will be moved. That means it's an increment. So it becomes what? Again, three. Okay. Ini, now ka, three systems, three printer will use it. Now, let us system one. I'll get the number of printer now. So he will uh, that process will come to the P operation. So wait is and goes to the next. Okay. So here what what will be the condition? Here we don't have any number of systems, number of um resources. So is equal to zero, which is less than or equal to zero. Here this condition is true. E condition true I can yell. Here no operation will be performed. Then apparently next operation perform J another. Here E condition falls out another way. E loop will never wait you. That means apparently is in the value where the glim system resource with two other can another. Upper is increment down. Here is one now. So your condition falls out. Your condition falls I can yell. Our resource never to the Okay. Simply three low maximum available resource is still in diarium. S zero on angle VTM. A lingle alka resource allocate him. Our process our resource in a UC the garinal. V operation perform team. That means our resource never to the gum. Resource in the value increment. This is counting semaphore. Hope it is clear. And there is a slight difference in binary semaphore because uh, there we are using zeros and ones alone. As its name implies binary. So, let me show the code here. So, here in binary semaphore. P operation will be like this. That means P of S while is equal to zero weight. Okay. And is equal to S minus one. This will be the P operation. And V operation will be like P of S equal to S equal to S plus one. This is the uh, difference in V and uh, P operation. So, we have already discussed a different uh, classical problems of synchronization like dining philosopher problem, reader writer problem, bounded buffer problem. So, I had given uh, the solution here in this uh, document, in this PDF of this note. So, please go through the, through the given lectures, given video, uh, sorry, given notes. Here you can see the producer operation by using weight and signal, that means semaphores. It also consumer problem. And then dining philosophers problem. Same weight and signals are used. And um, in reader writer problem, you can see the solution. So please go through it.